Okay, uh, we're here at 4525 uh, or 4527 Tahunga uh, Avenue Boulevard right here in uh, North Hollywood. This is a triplex that we're inspecting and we're uh, running our camera now through the main sewer line. We're going to run our camera wherever we can get a hold of the main line clean out. So, so far we found two clean outs. One on the side of the house, uh, like the end of a line cleaner that goes into the building. And then there's another clean out in the front here, in the garden in the front. Nevertheless, uh, we're here and we're just before the city sewer where there's a little bit of a route in the line. You want to try, see if you can get through it. Else we're going to try from the... Yeah, not really. Yeah, it's not really going, Al. Okay, so listen, we're going to try from the clean out in the front to get through there. That's out right at the city connection in the street. Now we do have a six inch clay pipe over here, or it could be a concrete pipe, difficult to tell. But it's in pretty fair condition. You know, obviously you just see some roots in the line. And uh, those can be easily cleaned out. A little bit of mortar in the line over here little bit of roots, very minor little amount of roots. This is definitely a clay pipe over here. It all looks pretty good. Very minor little roots coming in. Remember, this is a big six inch pipe. And remember, we cannot check every pipe in the house. It comes onto the property. Uh, comes onto the property here. Makes two turns over there. One is a sharp 90 degree turn. This is a section of ABS coming back to clay. Remember, we cannot check every pipe in the house. We check the main sewer line. That's what we do. Now this over here is the clean out that's in the front that will continue our inspection from. We're going to try to check the city connection. Uh, hopefully, we can get past that little route over there. But it was just kind of blocking the line up a little. Uh, right here we're coming underneath the building. Cast iron pipe. Obviously it's getting a little old. It does have a little bit of rust build up in it. In my opinion it looks still like it's in pretty fair condition. Remember we're looking at the inside of the pipe. We cannot see the outside. But this looks like it's pretty fair. It looks pretty decent. We always recommend that you never flush tampons, baby wipes, paper towels, things like that. Otherwise, this cast iron pipe looks like it's in pretty fair condition. Okay, so here it comes out of the clean out here on the side of the house. We're going to go ahead and pause the recording over here. Okay, we're so we've run our camera from that clean out in the front. Um, we just cannot get past that la the last little root there. It's just in an awkward position there. But you see the water's flowing very well. It's not backing up. And although we cannot finally check the city connection, we can tell you that it definitely is flowing very well. We're definitely going to recommend a hydro jetting over here so we could have a better look at the end of the line. My gut feeling tells me it's probably okay though. So we're going to pull the camera back. You can see the water's flowing very well here at a very good grade. You can see how it's going downhill. So looks pretty good. You're definitely going to need some periodic cleaning, no doubt about it. Um, otherwise, the sewer line looks like it's in pretty fair condition. Okay, here it is. We're going to stop, pause it, because uh, you want to look, look in the back. Okay. Listen, it's all ABS. So, uh, basically, that's all we can check. The, the unit right at the back was built in 1984, and you say, Alex, it was all oh. ABS. There's no way to pull it, because we can't pull out the washer and dryer. It's all stacked up in there. Yeah. So, have the general inspector check as much as he can over here. As far as the main line, we're going to recommend a hydrojetting. And we'll go ahead and stop the recording over here.